Hello guys, if you forget your sudo password on your Steam Deck, I have an easy solution here to reset the password without losing any data on your Steam Deck. If you forget your sudo password, first, you will not be able to install any system-related software through console. Let me quickly demonstrate this here. Under the Steam Deck desktop mode, go to System, then select Console. Then we type PASSWD here and hit enter on your keyboard. It will ask for your current password. If you type in the wrong password here, it will see authentication failure. So this means you are not able to change the password anymore. Also, you are not able to process any command installation from console. Secondly, you are not able to change to a new password under the user account. So what I mean here is, when you go to settings and then click on users, if you want to change the password here, you need to know your current password. Let's just click on change password. It will ask you to type in a new password and confirm that new password again. After you click set password, it will ask you to input the current password. So if you forget your current sudo password, you cannot change the password from here too. There are two methods to reset the password. The first method is factory reset your Steam Deck. This means everything on your Steam Deck will be erased which includes all your games and settings on your Steam Deck. It definitely should try to avoid using this method unless you don't care about the stuff that is currently stored on your Steam Deck. The second method is the best solution so we can reset the password without losing any data and the process is pretty simple to do. Let's jump into the tutorial for the second method now. Here are items that I suggested to use. A Windows PC a keyboard, one USB flash drive at least 8GB, one USB to USB-C adapter or a USB hub. If your keyboard has the built-in touchpad just like mine, so the mouse is not necessary in this tutorial. That's all the stuff we need. Let's move to step 1, create a recovery flash drive. I will do this process on a Windows PC, but you can definitely do the same thing from a Mac or Linux system. Let's move to my laptop screen. First, we need to download the Steam Deck Recover image from Steam official website. The download link in this video description. Let's click on the download. Check the box, then click download Steam OS Deck image. It took about 5 minutes to finish the download for me. So please just be a little bit patient here. Once the download is finished, we can now move to the Rufus website and download the Rufus. Also, it's linked in my video description. We need Rufus to build the recover image into our USB flash drive. So just click on Rufus 3.2 and download the latest Rufus here. Once the download is done, just click on Rufus and run it. I will just minimize the internet browser here. Now I will just plug the USB flash drive into my PC. Back to my laptop screen, we can see the USB flash drive has been detected by the Windows. On the roofers, make sure under device, you selected the USB flash drive that you just plugged in. Then under the boot selection, select the Steam Deck recover image that was downloaded previously. Make sure you check the box in front of list USB hard drives. The partition scheme should be MBR. Target system should be by us. Then just hit the start button. So this message just remind you that your USB flash drive will be formatted. So just click yes. This process took me about 10 minutes. So just be patient. After it's done, this window will pop up and just close it and then close the roofers. We can now eject the USB flash drive from our Windows PC. Now just unplug the USB flash drive and it is ready to use in step two. Let's close our laptop and move to step two. Boot Steam Deck into recover mode and reset the current password. This is the USB flash drive we created as step one. Plug in this USB flash drive with a USB-C adapter or a USB hub, then plug into the Steam Deck. First, press the volume down button, then press the power on button. Once you hear the beep sounds, release them together. Now the Steam Deck will boot into Boot Manager. Make sure you select the USB flash drive here to boot up your Steam Deck. This boot up will take about 5 minutes, so be patient here. Once we boot into recover mode, the first two things I would suggest to do is first, connect your keyboard. Second, connect your Wi-Fi network. After the keyboard and the Wi-Fi are connected, 
Go to the desktop, click and open terminal with repair tool. There are three commanders that we need to copy and paste them into the terminal. Make sure copy and paste those commander in the same order as I show on the screen. Also make sure copy one commander each time and paste into the terminal and then hit the enter key on your keyboard. I will put them under my video description so you can just copy from there. After all three commands are processed, we can just reboot our Steam Deck back to the Steam OS. Ok now we boot into the Steam OS. Let's switch to desktop mode first. Under desktop mode, go to system setting. Then under user, click change password. Type in new password that you would like to set. Type it again to confirm. Then click set password. Click change the wallet password too. Here you go guys, now you have changed your sudo password without factory resetting your Steam Deck. If you think what I just shared with you is helpful, please don't forget hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. By the way, I have another video up here to show you how to make your Steam Deck screen color looks vibrant and pop. If you like tips, tricks and tutorials on tech products, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.